Hey guys, welcome back. Today's video is going to be my top 20 Christmas movies as well as some Christmas goodies I'm going to show you guys and let's just jump right in. So if you guys like Christmas movies as much as I do, please, please, please let me know what your favorite movies are. I It doesn't even matter if it's Christmas related. What movies do you enjoy watching during the holiday season? Because I know I love me some Christmas movies. So let me grab some of my goodies that I was going to show you guys. So just to start it off, I know probably not a lot of people watch this, but me and my husband love this movie. I think I watch it year round, not even just only during the Christmas season, but it's Adam Sandler's Eight Crazy Nights. And it's also about Hanukkah since Adam Sandler is Jewish, and um, but it has some Christmas stuff in there as well. It's so hilarious and it just cracks me up every single time I watch this. So definitely love this movie. Some of them I only have in DVD form. The other ones I'm just going to read off the list that I have. Uh, of course, is Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. I talked about Bumble and Rudolph in my last video. And I also wore this dope-ass Bumble shirt. If you didn't see it, go to my next video. Go watch it. Go watch it so you can see. <laughs> but yes, we love this movie. Watch it all the time. Of course, How the Grinch Stole Christmas. Not only do I love this one because of my man Jim Carrey, but I watch the original as well every single year and throughout the year. So this is a definite must. Uh, of course, since I'm sporting his onesie, I might as well get his movie out too. And it's Will Ferrell and Elf. And I love this movie. It's just so hilarious. I love Will Ferrell and everything he does is like one of my favorite movies from old school to the Lego movie, uh, Ron Burgundy, Anchorman. I mean, the guy is hilarious. Uh, so those are the four that I have in DVD form. I do have other ones in DVD, but I'm not going to just show you guys a disc. So anyway, <laughs> uh, another movie that we love to watch is A Christmas Story. Um, this is from the 80s. My husband just finished watching it in its entirety for the first time because he's only always only caught it in bits and pieces. So we watched the whole movie and it was just so funny and we love it. Um, it's a Wonderful Life. I love that movie. My husband doesn't really watch it, but I definitely really like it. And I just love the message that it sends and it makes you kind of think about your life and things like that. Uh, this movie, I've already watched it, I think, like five times within the last few days. And it's National Lampoon's Christmas Vacation with Chevy Chase. I love Chevy Chase. He is hilarious in everything that he's in. I, is like one of my favorites from Spies Like Us to Nothing But Trouble to all the National Lampoon's vacation movies that he's in. Hands down one of the best. Um, of course, you can't have Christmas without watching Home Alone. Um, we love Home Alone. I think we watch it throughout the whole year. Uh, Nightmare Before Christmas. That's not only a favorite for Halloween, but it's also a favorite for Christmas. Uh, Tim Allen's Santa Claus, that's a classic. I like that one a lot more than I like all the other ones. I don't know what it is about the original ones usually. They're usually the best. Uh, Scrooge, that's another 80s movie, and that's with Bill Murray. If you don't know who Bill Murray is, he's in the original Ghostbusters, uh, Groundhog Day. I mean, the man is hilarious as well. And Scrooge is just too funny um of course polar express because you know polar express is just it's such a magical movie and i love tom hanks he's awesome as well uh we watch bad santa once in a while during the holiday season only because of the dirty jokes and you know the cursing you know sometimes you need a little bit of that <laughs> uh charlie brown christmas obviously we watch that throughout the year uh, Jingle All the Way with Arnold Schwarzenegger. That's a 90s movie. My, that's one of my husband's favorite movies. He loves that. Um, but we, we always watch that movie as well. Uh, let me see. What's another one? I don't know what that sound was. <laughs> uh, Arthur Christmas. That's one of the new ones. I think it came out a few years ago. Um, 
really cute movie. Uh, really, the, I like the storyline. My kids really like it. It's more of a kids movie anyway. Uh, we just finished watching Christmas with the Cranks, and that's with Jamie Lee Curtis and Tim Allen. And that one was a funny one, too. I really like that one. Um, of course, you cannot have Christmas without watching Die Hard with Bruce Willis. That's an 80s movie as well. Um, it's the first Die Hard movie in the whole... I don't know how many they have out, like six. Um, but that one is like the best one. I mean, I can't have Christmas without Die Hard. I know that's weird, but it's true. <laughs> uh, let me see. A Christmas Carol with Jim Carrey. I really like that one. The Family Man with Nicolas Cage. This is one of my husband's favorite movies as well. Um, it's just... It really makes you think and it really makes you wonder what if I had made these decisions, how my life would have changed. Would you even go back and change anything in your past? And would you want to see how your future would have changed? So I think it just makes you think about the choices in life and what they can lead to. So we really like that movie. Another one that we watch, of course, I love this movie. I watch it year round. Edward Scissorhands with Johnny Depp. That is a classic. I love, love, love that movie. Uh, we watch Frosty the Snowman once in a while. My kids aren't really into it that much. I don't know why, but they're just not. <laughs> So I think I just covered about 20 movies. I'm sorry, I was not counting. But um, if there's any other movies that maybe I might have left out that you enjoy, please let me know in the comment section below. I would love to hear other people's favorite holiday movies, what they like, and maybe I might see a movie that I've never seen and I figured, hey, let me try it out. You never know, right? So now just to talk about some of the Christmas goodies I got. Uh, I got a few Christmas socks. Some of them are actually a few couple years old, I guess. <laughs> and some of them are brand new. So the first one that I got that's pretty new is some elf socks. Super cute. It's got the little belt buckle. Little Jingle Bells at the top, real cute. I think I got those at the dollar store. Uh, these two, just a bunch of Christmas trees, nothing too fancy, but you know, it's cute. I've got an Argyle Penguin sock. These are kind of old, I think. Um, I got another Christmas tree one, real cute. And of course, you can't, you gotta have some Santa socks. You just have to. These, I believe, are from the dollar store, too. And these have been loved for a while because they're not that new. <laughs> so, another thing that I got, um, I went to Walmart. This is where I purchased this onesie, which is the e.l.f. onesie. And this was $20. And they had quite a few other ones. But I think they're sold out already because I went there the other day and I didn't see anything. So... They had these for the women, and this one I got for my husband, and it's like a bumble type of themed onesie. This was 20 bucks too, and it's really soft. I love it that it has pockets, because I don't know what it is with PJs and pockets. And that's my little one. He's a little upset. <laughs> so another thing that I got from Walmart is these awesome reindeer slippers. They were like seven bucks. Not only did they have these, but they had a uh, Santa, they had a penguin, and I think they had a polar bear if I'm not mistaken. But I like these the most because they're just so cute. And they're only seven bucks, guys. <laughs> So that was from Walmart, and I went to Target the other day because um, I got, there was a $10 off coupon if you spend $50 or more at Target. So I wanted to take advantage of that because my son has a holiday show coming up, and I needed to get him some, like, a festive shirt and some festive pajamas for their class party. So I got, I, all the stuff that I got is from their new line, the Cat and Jack line. So the first thing I got was these pajamas and these were 10 bucks. So not only long sleeve, but they're also long pants pajamas. And yeah, they're really cute. It's a really soft material. 
I haven't even taken the tags off, guys, because I just literally went the other day. So they're 10 bucks, and it's really cute. I like that they're not too crazy festive, but it's, it's still, like, subtle. <laughs> so I can't wait for him to wear that. Um... I got the these pajamas for my little guy because unfortunately he can't fit in his last year's pajamas as cute as they are. Um, again, this is from the Cat and Jack line, and this one was eight bucks. And this one comes with a long sleeve and with some fleece bottoms. So this is what they look like, and I'm really I'm really excited to put this on him. I don't know if I'll do it this week because we're supposed to get some cool weather. So I don't know. But I really like the bear because my little one is like a bear, literally. He eats like one, sleeps like one. He makes all kinds of bear sounds. So I felt like this was fitting. <laughs> so, yeah, again, this was eight bucks, which isn't too bad. And the last thing that I got from Target was this nice green. I would say it's kind of like a thermal for my oldest for his holiday show. And this one was ten bucks as well. So it's not too bad. Um, I don't know. I kind of wish it was a little bit cheaper just because it's just a regular thermal shirt. But it's nice. I mean, 10 bucks, you can't beat that. Um, they had other stuff that was there that was real cute. They had like some thermals, some red ones. But I wasn't about to spend almost $20 on a thermal shirt. For a kid that's only going to wear like once, maybe twice. So anyway, <laughs> off the subject. So that's all that I have for you guys. Thank you so, so much for watching. Again, if there's any Christmas movies that I might have missed or let me know what your favorites are, please leave it in the comment section below. And if you want to see some of my Christmas trees for my kids or the real tree that we just got, um, go, to, go ahead and check out my Instagram. It's in the description below. Um, just click it it'll take you to my Instagram page and you could check out the the way that I decorated my kids trees so anyway thank you guys so so much for watching I hope you all have a beautiful day I hope to see you soon and I'll see you next time okay bye